Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Rhythm Clapping with Mr. Gordon. Today's going to be a viewer's choice episode, so I asked a few of my students to choose a movie for us to clap along with. And i got to be honest, I have no idea where we are, I don't know what movie this is, and so it's going to be interesting to see which music we're going to be clapping along are with. Are you serious right now? Hey, <laughs> a talking hat, that's pretty cool. What? Are you telling me you don't know what movie this is? No, I have no idea. I mean, I'm assuming with the talking hat and the magic, maybe it's a Disney movie, so Frozen? I don't know. Maybe we could clap Let It Go. What the... Were you born under a rock? I'm the Sorting Hat from Harry Potter. It's only one of the biggest movie franchises of all okay. time. Harry Potter, that makes sense. You know, it's been so long since I've seen those movies, I totally forgot about them. I don't... Yes, yes. Well, you didn't forget about those Avengers movies, did you? Fair enough. So coming at you live from Hogtie Castle. Hogwarts! From Hogwarts Castle, let's clap some Harry Potter music. Here we go. Bruh. Alright guys, if you're watching this video and if you're not one of my students, let me introduce myself. My name is Rich Gordon and I'm a junior high school band director. It's my job to make sure that the students are learning about music and having fun. So here we are outside of Hogwarts Castle. And you know what, I just figured it's such a wonderful night out. Let's go ahead and do our rhythm clapping warm ups outside. And the sorting hat kicked me out, so. And stay out. But don't worry about that, we'll go back inside as soon as we're ready to clap his favorite music. Here's your warm up. Alright, if you want to learn how to clap the Harry Potter music, you're going to have to count in 3-4 time signature. You know what, some people call that 3 quarter time, and coincidentally, when Harry Potter first boarded the train to go to Hogwarts back in the first movie, they had to board on 9 and 3 quarters platform. Which has nothing to do with what we're doing right now, I just wanted to let you know that I'm a big fan of the movies! Sure you are! Alright, time signature. So, the 3 on top represents how many beats there could possibly be in every measure. So how many beats per measure, that's the top number. The bottom number is what type of note gets a beat. So in this case, there's a four on the bottom which represents quarter notes. So there can be three quarter notes in every measure. If the bottom number was an eight, there could only be three eighth notes. And if the bottom number was a two, then there could be three half notes. I know that's kind of confusing, but for right now, all you need to know is that you're gonna count to three in every measure. Here's your beat. All right, feel the beat. When we're counting in three, four, we always wanna feel the downbeat just a little bit more than the other beats. So heavy on the one. One, two, three. Feel the beat. Two, three. One, two, three. All right, you're gonna clap first. Get your hands ready. Don't forget there's a dotted half note and a dotted quarter note in this, just like we learned in my other rhythm clapping videos. You're going first. Ready? And one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, and three. One, two, three. And stop. All right, listen to me clap it now. Remember, I'm only gonna count to three because we're in three, four. Ready? One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, and three. One, two, three, and stop. All right, let's clap together now. Hands ready? And one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, and three. One, two, three, and stop. All right, ladies and gentlemen, great job. You deserve a round of applause for that. I'm gonna go in and talk to the Sorting Hat. If you want to, go ahead and stay outside and watch another collection of my favorite musical fail videos. This one features violin players. Oh no. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back inside of Hogwarts. I told the Sorting Hat here that we are ready to clap the Harry Potter theme song, so here we go. Now hold on a minute. You can't clap our rhythms looking like that. You need to be properly dressed. Well, what do you mean? Ugh, can somebody please help Mr. Gordon adorn the proper attire? No, no, this is really not necessary. Okay, listen, I gotta... <laughs> Look at you. You're a wizard now. Well, that's quite an improvement for a music teacher, isn't it? <laughs> you know, maybe now when you wave that wand around, your music students might actually look at you. <laughs> okay, okay, are you quite finished? Let's get started. Wait, 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 wait. How many music teachers does it take to screw in a light bulb? <laughs> Evan, let's go. All right. We all know that it only takes one music teacher to screw in a light bulb. We just stand there and hold the light bulb, and the whole world revolves around us. Oh, 
All right, guys, let's get ready to clap the Harry Potter theme song. Now this music was written by John Williams and it has a pickup note at the beginning of it. But since we're in 3-4, that pickup note is going to happen pretty quickly because I'm only going to count to 2 before you clap on count 3. Let's try that first. I'd like you to clap count 3 and count 1 after I count to 2. Hands ready? And 1, 2, 3, 1. Okay, so that pickup note happens pretty fast. Alright, I think we're ready. Go ahead and stay with the beat. Hands ready? Remember, I'm only going to count to 2 before you start. Here we go. 1, 2, 3, one, two, three, 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 and stop. All right, now listen to me clapping. Remember, I'm only going to count to two before I start. Ready? And one, two, three, one, two, and three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, and three, one, two. Three, one, three, three, and stop. All right, now I'm gonna put the pitches into the rhythms here, and let's clap together. Get set, hands ready, and one, two, three, one, two, and three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, and three, one, two, three, one, two, three, and stop. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you definitely deserve another round of applause. And of course, one of our easy buttons. That was easy. All right, guys, that's going to do it for us today. Thank you for watching. And if you like this video, please hit that like button. Please subscribe. And of course, watch some of my other rhythm clapping videos. As always, stay safe, stay happy, stay healthy. And I'll see you again next time. Okay, so what's the difference between a music teacher and a pizza? The pizza can feed a family of four. <laughs> oh, are you mad that I didn't sort you into the house of blues? <laughs> okay, 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 I'll be good, I'll be good. I've always loved music teachers, actually. <laughs>